you are demanding more from a planter than ever before. Your investment in a planter is one of the most critical you will make because your crops must be properly planted if they are to produce maximum yields and returns on your big investment in land, seed, fertilizer, chemicals, equipment, and labor. You want on-target planting. And Dallas Chalmers 73 and 74 plate-type planter units can hit the bullseye in your fields, crops, and soils. A planter must accomplish several functions. Accurate depth control. Place the seed at the right depth and do it consistently. Accurate spacing. Space the seed uniformly so each plant receives equal nutrition and moisture and for the total population you've planned. Proper coverage and soil contact. Firming the seed into moist soil for fast germination. Precise chemical application. Place chemicals properly to control plant environment and it must have the reliability and durability to maintain all of these functions for years of dependable service. The new 73 and 74 series plate type unit combine time-proven dependability and modern design features to accomplish these five functions right on target. The 73 runner opener works well in low moisture and loose soils while the 74 double disc handles trash or sticky conditions. They will plant a wide variety of crops, such as corn, soybeans, grain sorghum, Spanish peanuts, delinted cotton, sunflowers, peas, edible beans, castor beans, and beets. The hopper bottom assures accurate seed spacing. All components of a plate unit are critical in the material they're made of and the way they are manufactured. The hopper bottoms in the Alice Chalmers units are precision die castings that are made in a metal mold which permits very close tolerances. Seed plates are chrome plated to prolong the life of hopper bottoms and plates. Short 14 inch drop promotes even spacing by reducing seed bounce. The fiberglass seed hopper holds 75 pounds. It is translucent so you can see the seed supply. Independent press wheel drive provides the flexibility for mounting units on different type frames. Drive is transmitted smoothly by roller chain to the hopper drive. The quick change sprockets let you change planting rates quickly without tools. The press wheel axle and sprockets are plated to retard rusting. Shields protect sealed bearings from dirt for longer life. Depth is easily adjusted by a convenient pin. Five different press wheels are available. The open center wheel leaves the row mellow for easy seed emergence. A traction tread tire firms soil over the entire width for mellow ground. Center rib tires compress dirt directly over the seed and are recommended for no-till and minimum tillage applications. The dual ribbed tire firms soil around the seed and is recommended for conventionally tilled conditions. Optional semi-pneumatic gauge wheels beside the opener provide more precise depth control. Simply move the spring-loaded handle for quick adjustments. They may be easily removed if soil is wet and sticky. A 7-inch semi-pneumatic press wheel is available to increase soil to seed contact for faster emergence. Covering equipment is available for use with and without gauge wheels. Knife or disc covers control the amount of soil over the seed. Other attachments customize the 73 and 74 units to your requirements. Depth bands in four sizes regulate planting depth of the double disc unit, recommended for small seeds such as sugar beets. Disc furrowers push dry dirt and trash aside to permit planting in moist soils for faster germination. Down pressure springs add 100 pounds of force to improve penetration and reduce unit bounce in adverse conditions. A chain shield protects herbicide or insecticide drive chain in grassy no-tillage conditions. Choice of counting or non-counting monitors keep you informed on planting performance. If seed flow is interrupted, an alarm sounds. Counting units show row population from which you can determine acre population. 
Granular insecticide and herbicide applicators have 35-pound fiberglass hoppers that are easily mounted or removed. Calibrated dials provide accurate control of application rates. A 7-inch fan is available for banding insecticide over the row. A 14-inch fan is furnished with herbicide attachments. An optional windshield helps prevent granules from being blown off the row. The 73 and 74 units will plant at 15-inch row spacing without gauge wheels or 18-inch row spacing with gauge wheels. Narrow rows are becoming more popular for soybeans and Alice Chalmers gives you narrow row capability. Alice Chalmers builds planters in several configurations. With a wide choice of frames and attachments, you can customize an Alice Chalmers planter to your exact requirements with flexibility for future changes in your planting practices. The Model 330 pull type planter is available in four or six row sizes. Roller chain drives on both fertilizer and planting systems increase reliability, improve appearance, and run smoother than link chain. Two transport wheels are standard with a four wheel option for the six row. Four wheels are recommended on six row planters with fertilizer hoppers. Dry fertilizer attachment with large 550 pound non-corrosive fiberglass hoppers can be used on the 330 planter. Fast hopper removal permits easy dumping and quick cleaning. Spring augers meter fertilizer accurately. Two hoppers on four row and three on six row planters provide good capacity and fewer stops for refills. A liquid fertilizer attachment with a 200 gallon polyethylene tank, squeeze pump, and 13 and a half inch double disc openers is available. Hydraulic markers alternate automatically at row ends. Alice Chalmers 73 or 74 units are well adapted to the rugged 333 three bar frame. Three bar design permits mounting no-till coulters on the front bar, fertilizer openers on the middle, and planter units on the rear toolbars. The tongue is long enough to allow sharp turns with dual wheel tractors. Bolted construction lets the frame flex as it follows ground contours without breakage common to welded designs. The heavy walled three and a half inch bars come in three different lengths for four, six, or eight rows. The no-till coulter prepares a narrow seed bed. The coulter is mounted on a heavy duty rubber torsion spring, an Alice Chalmers exclusive. It has the muscle to hold the 17-inch coulter at the proper working depth, yet protects it from rocks and other obstructions. For reduced tillage, a coil shank provides field cultivator-like performance ahead of planter units on the 333 planter frame. Choose fertilizer attachments with 550-pound hoppers or liquid attachment with 200-gallon tanks. For really big planting capacity, the 600 folding frame handles 8 wide or 12 narrow rows. Six transport wheels provide plenty of load carrying capacity. Outer wings can float up or down 10 degrees to follow contours. A lift cylinder on each wing quickly folds it to a vertical position and transport width is reduced to 19 and a quarter feet. Like the 333, you can equip the 600 frame with no-till coulters for reduced or conservation tillage planting. A liquid chemical attachment with 500 gallon seamless polyethylene tank is available. A ground level fill system makes refilling faster and easier. If you prefer a mounted planter, the 300 two bar frame is a good choice to handle up to six rows in conventional or conservation systems. The Category 2 three-point hitch matches most tractors. You can team up Alice Chalmers units and any of several toolbar frames for high-capacity planting in conventional seed beds. The toolbar creates a close coupled planting system that follows ground contours in varying conditions. Sizes from 4 to 12 rows match your needs. The new model 117 toolbar is available for planters in 6-row 34-inch through 12 row 30 inch sizes in both folding or non-folding version. The 7x7 bar provides a low cost planter frame with superior strength but with less overall weight. The square toolbar provides a solid foundation for planter units or cultivator gangs. 
units and gangs stand straight and resist leaning, as can happen with a rectangular bar. One hydraulic cylinder on the 117 toolbar folds both wings over 90 degrees for narrow transport. A valve locks hydraulic oil in the cylinder for transporting safely. Transport width of a 12-row 30-inch planter is only 18 feet 8 inches. Folding toolbars can be operated with the wings locked rigid for level ground or allowed to float in uneven terrain. One pin per hinge can be quickly installed for rigid operation. Each folding wing has a stop to hold it in vertical position for transporting. The three-point hitch will accept tractors with category two or three standard or quick hitch. Two parking stands are standard equipment and allow one man hitching. Accessories include adjustable gauge wheels and lift assist wheels reduce load on the tractor hitch and help maintain tractor stability. For non-folding bars, an endwise transport system is available. Axles swing up out of the way for field work and the hitch is adjustable for tractors or trucks. Hydraulic roll markers give precise control and knee action design helps avoid obstructions at row ends. A sequencing valve automatically alternates markers at row ends. Select the frame that matches your power, system, and acreage requirements. Mounted or pull type. Conventional, minimum, or no tillage. Then, mount 73 or 74 plate type units with exactly the right attachments to match your specific planning needs. You get accurate spacing, uniform depth, proper coverage and soil firming, and precision chemical application with proven dependability and big daily capacity. That's on-target planning from Alice Chalmers, the rising power in farming.